kind these days, aren't you? What, what, what are you even doing out here? It's the holidays. You're supposed to be back at the village spending it with the family. I'm just out here kicking rocks. Oh, really? That's great, isn't it? Just kick rocks while your wife and your kid are back home. What do you want? Look, I just thought that maybe you wouldn't want to be alone this Christmas. So why don't you just come to dinner with us? It'll be good for you. I think I'll pass. Richard, you can't live in your own bubble for the rest of your life. I can do whatever I want. Look, I didn't want to have to be harsh because you've been through a lot. But I think I have to show you some tough love. You need to move forward with your life. You've got people depending on you. Yes, what happened is devastating and it's heartbreaking and it's just terrible. But you have so much more ahead of you. Do this for Hope. She wouldn't want to see her dad like this. You don't know what she would want. No, you're right. But I can only guess that it's not the way you're being right now. Look, I'll leave you alone for now. But I hope you show up. If not for me, at least for Beth. Because you still have another kid. I hope Richard shows up. I really do. Because I want him there. But I think Remy and Beth need him to be there. I've done my part though. I've tried talking to him. I don't want to lose hope though. I, I don't want to just give up on him and be like, okay, well, he's just, he's just gone. So we just got to hope for the best now. Oh my gosh, it is Christmas Day. Why is everybody in my house? Okay. That's weird. It's Christmas Day. Do, 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 do. I am so excited. Um, I'm going to go pick up Remy and Beth. Hopefully Richard too. And we're going to head over to Adam's house. I think Willow and Ryan already know to go there. So they should be fine. But what? Who's that guy in their house? Why'd she, why'd she have her house boarded up? Excuse me, Mitchell. Can you, um, Mitchell? Mitchell, can you move out the way? No? Okay, let me try to figure out a way to get in without letting Mitchell in. Because I think that was there for a reason. Alright, I got in. Remy! Um, why do you have the door boarded up? Because people keep feeling sorry for me still, and they keep trying to bring me stuff, and I don't like it anymore. Oh, why don't you just tell them to just leave or something? Because I feel bad. All right, I get it, I get it. Um, I guess you have Ashley here just as your guard. Um, but you guys, Beth, it is Christmas time. Are you guys excited? Huh? I think Beth is over the moon. That is good. By the way, Remy, um, why is my cute little darling over there wearing guard's clothes and carrying around a sword? Oh, <laughs> she wanted that for her present. Don't you think she's a little young for a sword? Yeah, I know, but she promised she'd be careful. Okay, I just think the whole village is going to need to keep an eye on you to make sure, you know, she doesn't, like, run with it and stab herself. I've seen her playing around at the park. She's a tough one. I know. She doesn't get that from me. <laughs> I'm scared of everything. She doesn't get that from Richard either, trust me. But... I love that she's so full of life. But you guys, we better get going because this is more like a Christmas breakfast than a dinner. So, let's go. So, we're all here. Oh, this is nice. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. <laughs> well, you're in a good mood. Um, Before we eat, uh, maybe I should say a little speech. I just want to say that even though some of you seem really distracted, um, that I'm happy everyone could make it except for Richard, but we all understand. And it's also nice for all of us to be able to be together. Uh, it's been a tough year, but moments like this make everything worth it to see us and those kids just having fun and enjoying the holidays. So cheers to the holidays. I had to excuse myself a second because this is so weird. No one's eating, no one's really talking. And Lily's pregnant. Which I think is kind of, I mean, not that she could have controlled it or anything, but it's kind of insensitive because Remy just lost a child. Well, I'm not going to say nothing, you know, I never really liked Lily anyway. The kids seem to be hitting it off really, really well. Um, Forrest and Beth are getting along. 
And then Hunter and Riddle are like the cool kids that are like, I don't want to be part of this. Anyway. And, uh, yeah. Let's just to do this. Yep, no one's talking much. I feel like they're arguing. And then you've got them over there. I think Ryan is talking to Remy, which is good. Hey, Adam. Um, I want to talk to you. I got really excited about the present and then I realized that it's empty. How did you know? Did you open it? I didn't have to. So why trick me? I got really excited. Well, it represents the way I feel about you. What? Nothingness? No, no. It, I just mean... There's nothing I could ever give you to show how grateful and thankful I am for everything you've done. Aw, thanks, Adam. I still got it. Shut up, idiot. Hey, Sai, look who's here. What? <gasps> Richard! Nice to have you here. Oh, it's not even that late, but I'm exhausted. I had to be up so early for that little breakfast that uh, I just feel so tired. But it was so totally worth it. I'm so glad I went. The kids had a lot of fun. And I'm so glad Richard showed up. He didn't say much all morning, but you know what? It's a first step and that's all that counts. What are you doing out here? Well, hey. Hey, Adam. <laughs> How'd you find me? I followed you. Okay. <laughs> That's not creepy at all. I just wanted to see where you were headed. Mm, just kind of wanted some time to clear my head. What's Forrest doing over there? He wanted to say Merry Christmas to his mom. Aw, that's nice of him. By the way, I do want to say something. I enjoyed the dinner and stuff, but Forrest and Beth were getting along a little too well, and I'm just saying it now because I know our luck. They'll probably end up falling in love and then they'll want to get married and stuff. We both have to make a promise that we're not going to let it happen. My promise? Only if you give me another chance. Adam, no. I appreciate dinner and all that stuff, but... No. No means no, okay? Are you going to be this stubborn forever? Yes, I am. Will you at least go watch a movie with Forrest or not? A movie? You don't even have, like, a movie theater around here or anything like that. Well, I built a secret little room in the basement. It's called the Man Cave. <laughs> if it's a man cave, then I can't go. Sorry. He would love it if you showed up. <sighs> I can't believe I'm saying this right now, but... Okay. Deal. But I get to set the date, because I'm going to be really busy. So... I... I'll let you know when I'm ready. Yes. This is all I wanted for Christmas. <laughs> is it really? You're a sado. I just realized Adam actually didn't give me anything for Christmas. What a jerk. I should have told him he should give me one before uh, me agreeing to go on his date with him. But I can't go to this date anytime soon because I have a trip to the witch. So, because I don't know what to expect, I am going to fully plan out for this and get as prepared as possible. I've got to start, you know, getting all my armor, everything together, money. I don't know what else I could possibly need, but I can't let anybody know that I'm doing this. So, I need to keep this all hidden and it should be good to go. But seriously, Beth? And forest. It better not happen. It better not. No, no, no. And I just figured it out. Beth met Riddle and then that's when she wanted her sword and that's when she wanted to change her clothes. She just wants to be like Riddle. <laughs> Which is cute. It is. But I'm just like, please don't go kill yourself. That would not be good. Like, next thing you know, she's going to be sliding down the slide. Boom. Stab herself. Nope. I don't want that. Not at all. So we're going to need food lots of it because i don't know how to get there probably need a horse as well do i have a saddle anywhere yes i do perfect do we have any horses in the farm i have to go check if not we're gonna have to get all these little things so we need to get a saddle Ugh, we have some potions already uh just in case i'll take a gold apple i'll see what else why are everybody here they're just always here what the heck they shouldn't be in here with that chest. 
Um, hey guys. <laughs> uh, let me just, uh... Oh, look, I just want to plant this right here, right now. Yeah, look at it. Oh, honey. <laughs> just wanted to build a little mini Christmas tree here. Yeah, that's it. Oh, my gosh. They cannot have looked in there. That'll be really bad. And no one could tell Remy, Richard, or anyone that I'm doing this. Because if they find out, they're going to flip out.